all right we're here now i was gonna go in and then get the stuff i needed to get first but i decided not to do that because i know that this place is pretty much on the verge of closing and i don't want to do that so now i'm gonna get my stuff like then i'm picking up now then i'm gonna run in there afterwards and then get the rest of the stuff because i know if i wait and then do it the other way around it's gonna be a problem when i if I were to wait longer, they'll start saying, oh yeah, well, no, we didn't, no, you waited too long. So I'm just gonna wait these guys to bring it out and I'll run in there real fast and then get the rest of it. I think there were like the two items I needed, I think was, I needed milk and uh, I think it was cheese. They said they didn't have it. So I'll just go in and then get the rest of it. So that's what I'm waiting on. Waiting on these guys to get here. I see people walking around. Pretty sure they already had it. Just tell them to put it in the trunk. Put it in the trunk in the cooler. Because I always keep a... Hmm. Send me some kind of message. But I always keep like a, a cooler kind of in my trunk area. And it's typically like a, if I go get groceries or like food, I just put it back there and then that way it doesn't go bad. But it's not really necessary as much now because it's cold outside but i just put it in there that way i can just have it and say okay got these things but those next three items i'll go and go get those real fast run and get them items that i don't really need i i don't even think i need a, a, a big buggy for that stuff uh so go and get that oh look it's here here's here already what's up man what's up with the name Peterson, DJ. Yes, sir. Yes, yeah. sir. It's me. All right, real quick, we are out of stock of all three of these. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go in there and get them, or like get the alternatives after you drop these off. Hell yeah, hell yeah. yeah. And it is gonna charge you for them, but you should get a refund for these like separately by like twelve. Couple months. days. Yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm aware. I know how they do. Right, for sure, for sure. Where would right. you like it though? Uh, I have like a cooler in the trunk, but yeah, I'm gonna put it back there. Let me move right. it for you. So what I'm gonna do, I have to go in there and get the rest of it. Then we're gonna bounce out of here. All right, thank you. Have a good one. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. Okay. The package has been secured. Did this thing out there? I have to go in here and finish the job. Okay. I got a small machine to fit in another big one. And I also got the funny thing is this is the milk that I ordered. But as I kind of walked by, the guy was put into the uh, shell area. So I got that. To get one more item, then we're out of here. Okay, update. I just went inside of this place. I had an interview for a job. I wanted to see what they had to offer. I finished the interview. Now it's time to go and get a workout in. This is already planned. I planned it uh, for the last couple days. I knew I would be coming in here. Today's Tuesday, March 14th, 2023. So uh, now I'm gonna go get a workout. I'm doing legs today. I'm already in Dearborn, which is the fortunate part. I'm like in a part of Dearborn where I have to drive to the section that I need to get to, which is the part that sucks. I'm gonna go get food afterwards, I think. I think I may either get food or just say the hell with it and eat the food I have at the house. So I've already prepared some stuff. So it's gonna take me nine minutes to get to the gym from here. So I'm gonna get into it right about now.
pretty much done. Gonna do 400 and then wrap this up. Then we're gonna go over there. All right. 399 and and 400. So wrapping this up over here. Now I'm gonna go to the other side. Finish it. I just wanted to do 35 minutes pretty much. From here, I'll do all over there. Get out of here. Plus, these shoes are not really the most optimal thing to wear. We're doing cardio, so still got any of those sweat droplets. Let's get into the second leg of this. Watch some more. Let's see. Okay, finally got here. I picked up my food, chicken sandwich from the famed uh, Chili's. It's chicken sandwich, fries. Uh, it's actually been a while since I've been to this location. I, I usually go to the one that's kind of like in the Allen Park area. This is the one, it says Southfield, but it's basically Detroit. And it's like kind of on that dividing line. So they consider it Southfield. But it's been a while since I've been here. It was funny because as I was in the gym and I was kind of prepping like, to get my food, I was finishing up my workout. And I said, like, oh, you know, I'm gonna get some food before I go home. And then I started making an order and then they're like, oh, we're not processing online orders at this time. I'm like, what the hell? And then after I kind of got changed and then was about to make my way out again, I was like, you know what, let me try again. And then they finally went through. Uh, I drove in, got my order at the lemonade. Maybe some chips too, which I probably won't be eating that much. Mm. Fame cheesecake. I'll enjoy that later. So I'm probably gonna eat, uh, last middle of the night, I'm gonna eat like some coconut shrimp. I made some, what was it? Um, I baked some potatoes. So I'll probably be eating those for the next couple days. And then I'm gonna go buy some protein too, like chicken. I've been looking at the price of like, like cutlets of chicken. Like if I were to get like chicken breasts, like Tyson chicken breasts, I think they're like 17 bucks for a three pound kind of like bag of them. Like inflation is crazy. But anyway, I just wanted to talk, touch base with you guys. I to know about the situation, how things been going. Everything has been going really well. It's getting warmer, which is great. I've been kind of doing a lot of uh, kind of contract work for companies. Uh, this one company came in, they wanted me to help them with some stuff. They wanted it was more of an hourly basis type thing. I went in and did some stuff with them. This company that I kind of showed you guys before something happened where I did something for them on Thursday, Friday, they wanted me to come back in. The weather was bad, so couldn't do anything that day. Monday came around, weather was bad, couldn't do anything then, and then today rolled around. Today I had to do another, I had another meeting with another company. There's always one thing to keep in mind when you work for that kind of company, because it was basically, I think the email said, oh, this is a 95 job. If this isn't for you, then just let us know. I'm like, right? Chicken sandwich. There we go. Look how great it looks. Pre decent presentation, not too much lettuce. No cheese on the lettuce, tomato. They're special sauce. Mm. Pretty good. People just keep asking me, do I think is this chicken sandwich is on the level of Chick-fil-A? I don't think so. It's good though, but it's not. It's like a different style, different taste. 
I like the bread in that Chick-fil-A more. And I think their sandwich is cleaner, I guess is the best way to put it. it since it doesn't have any condiments on there, and it, it, like the flavor is based off of the breading and like the seasoning and it, or food, it's even though like when I eat the fried chicken sandwich, it doesn't taste like it's greasy, if, that, if it makes any sense. I'll eat it and then I'll feel, okay, well, I can go do anything else after I eat it. Like a lot of times this one isn't that bad, but I have had situations where I've eaten food from here and other restaurants like that. And it's like, it kind of, it sits there, you know? But what I'm probably gonna do from a workout standpoint, I did less today. Continue to work out again. It's getting warmer now. I gotta renew my uh, membership at Kite next month. I'll do that. And I'll probably get a membership at Wayne State as well. Cause it's gonna come a time where I'll be able to do so. So that's gonna be the next thing coming up. Fun times. I'll get to, what I'm thinking is I'll probably get my old summer or like end of the, uh, our graduation membership. Work out there, it'll be my backup gym because parking situation down there is kind of horrible. But I don't mind uh, going there on Sundays. So if anything, it'll be my Sunday area. That way I don't have to drive. This is time to work out. I can just go over there because I don't have to pay for parking on Sundays. Any job I choose is still going to be fitness with any content happening. I'm never going to stop working out. I feel it's necessary for positive mindset. Helps promote blood flow, health. I feel pretty good when I work out. I feel pretty good after I work out. And I like moving around. There'll be some home improvement stuff happening. So we're just gonna get into it, but that being said, I'm gonna wrap this video up here. Finish the rest of this chicken sandwich. I only took one bite, which is unlike me. I'm trying to be civilized in front of the camera, I guess. But if you guys have been enjoying the content, please like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. I gotta be down here at Eastern Market right now. Yeah. Hey, Eastern Market down the bridge. You know what I'm that? Put that on there, brother. All right. Got a good corn beef. How you want your shit cut, Jay? You want to fry? You got it, man. Four or five pounds. And then, uh. So you're not coming over, bro? Nope. That was 1967. I don't care what you're talking about. Get off me, Freezing out here too. Cold. What's going on, people? Welcome to today's video. DJ coming back at you. Today is March 21st, 2023. <sighs> it's been a very chaotic last couple days. Last time I I think I recorded, I was with my brother. We went out to a, uh, a diner. We went to Eastern Market and he trying to have me go to a diner to get some food. He's like, oh man, come on, let's go get some food. And then we went to this diner and he's talking trash to the, 
the, the people who were serving the food, I thought it was crazy and uh, pretty much ended it there and then I've kind of just been trying to work on things. Not really been going to the gym. And plus it got really cold too. I remember, and I'm pretty sure on the footage, it started snowing really bad. Like it was, at first it was pretty decent outside. I think it was kind of like in the, what I say decent, probably like closer to the 40s. And then all of a sudden, the temperature just dropped down drastically. And it got to the point to where it was like maybe in the, I want to say the, probably the 20s like the mid 20s and i was like holy crap man what what is going on out here but it got my point is it got really cold really fast and then we just had to try to you know deal with it to try to get through it and it's kind of what it is they're really doing construction over here but kind of did that so now today is the 21st it's i think a couple days ago was the first days of spring so that's good. So now it's starting to warm up a little bit, which I like, because now I don't have to worry about, you know, any of the kind of extracurriculars, like all of this cold weather has been kind of a downer for me. I'm just trying to, you know, push through it and get, you know, get through this. That way I can kind of get back into my routine of working out again. Typically, when it starts getting super cold, weather gets crappy. I don't like leaving the house as much. This guy tonight. Okay, I see what's going on here. Oh, they closed the ramp on me. I was like, what the hell going on? Like, uh, there was two people. One told me to stop. The truck drove by. And then another dude ran across the street to pull the cone back past the uh, exit. So now, I have to take the long way to get here. It's funny because I ordered, like, some food, too, as always, right? I order food as I'm going to my destination. That way, I can have something to eat after the workout. I'm going to eat the sandwich and then probably the fries because I don't want them getting cold. And then everything else, I just kind of save until I work out and get back home. So I have to get gas too, but that's probably going to be something I'll do later. But it's it's kind of crazy, man. It's it's been a very very chaotic last couple of days. I still have to do my tax stuff, wrap it up. I've been kind of gathering documents and getting all that stuff ready to meet with people. That way I can just knock that out as quickly as possible. And uh, that's pretty much it. It's been, like I said, it's just been steady doses of work. I've been talking to people about, oh, this closed over there, it's your turn. But I've been talking to people about, uh, like just doing some side projects too. That's kind of been something that's been in the works as well. I mean, I, I, it's like when it starts getting warm out, I don't mind kind of traveling more. I'm always a little reluctant, especially when you get to the point to where it's colder outside. Cause I always, then you have to start factoring in people's driving habits and like the stuff that happens there and all of that stuff. So I, I just, I just try to take a backseat to that and say, okay, well, maybe I need to just take a couple steps back and then wait, no way nothing happens. But, oh damn, Wayne State's territory now. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna continue to drive now is gonna, this is gonna take me longer than expected cause I couldn't just straight hit the freeway where it was backed up cause they're doing construction pretty much all lower. So now I'm gonna take an alternate route, try to get on this freeway go to uh, the gym, go pick up my food, and then we'll see. I, today, I think I'm gonna do chest. That's gonna be the workout. I'll do some chest stuff. How do bench press and stuff like that. And I'm trying to go early, as early as possible now because the earlier I go, the less of a crowd I run into. Usually, I notice when I try to go 
later, like if I were to go like an hour or so later, I would run into a crowd and then I would have to deal with you know, that stuff that's going on there with all of those people around. And although it's not, I don't mind it too much. It's, it kind of gets kind of crazy when you go in there. They have all kinds of stuff going on down here. But anyway, we're gonna get over here. Go from there. It's lively down here too. I'm like in the Wayne State area. It's like it's the, the COVID thing is it's pretty much over. Alright. See you guys later in the video. Alright, after a long, long, long delay, I finally received my food. I went in there. So who's the food for again? It's like for DJ. Like, okay. And then like three people came in, even though I ordered my food, had the food before me. It could have been because I was a little early too. I'll take that into consideration, but cheesecake, salad. So we'll make the determination after we get some chips, which I think you guys already know how I feel about the chips. And they gave me some fries and uh, a sandwich. These fries look a little, a little toasty. And obviously a drink, but what it looks like. I want to say it's a different to the fries because they're darker than usual. It's salsa that I never use. But there's some dressing that I really don't use. I use my own dressing at the house. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to eat this and go hit the gym. My time I hit the gym, it should be close to one. Now, because I'm going to go get gas too. But I may go get gas afterwards. I'm just hit the gas station on my way back. These fries don't seem too, they're not cold, cold, but they're not as hot as I thought they would be. But we will see. Yeah. All right. We must knock down those fries. Let me show you guys a sandwich. Sandwich. They put way too much sauce on this thing. Way too much. Flip it to get it kind of even killed, but they definitely sauce this thing down. Okay. Let's see. Flipping it made it better, but a little on the saucy side. Typically, they put the sauce on the bottom, go from there, and then like this piece of chicken too is a little off too. Now how we roll it, we eat it anyway. Pay my money for this, but. All in all, pretty decent. What I'm gonna do when I get in the gym, I'm gonna do some bench press, probably a couple accessory movements. Then I'm also gonna do some uh, cardio, obviously. Probably gonna watch Mandalorian. Workout shouldn't take that long. I also have a meeting. I'm going to probably take care of at like 2 o'clock. So I'll do that. And I wanted to try to edit a little bit while I was in there, but I don't think I'm going to do that. We'll see. Depends on how long I stick around in this way. Because if I can get in one of those offices, I would stay there and then just do some work. But that's all heavily dependent on what things look like in there as far as the people. I 
and it's just like that. This thing's almost gone. I've been thinking about going places, trying different types of food. I think I was thinking like chicken sandwiches, but. They try not to restrict you, son. Just that. There's a lot of eateries in Michigan in general that are there that I'd never go to. But I'd stick to the same spots and then just go to them over and over and over again, which people give me crap about. But it works for me, so I'm going to keep doing it. Whatever works. Whatever works. Anyway, time to the gym now. See you guys there. All right, we've arrived at the gym. I actually just spoke to the person I need to speak to about uh, opportunity that just came up. She kind of let me know what it was. So I have to go meet with this person on Thursday, I think it is. So I'm gonna go out there and meet with him, see what everything is about, and go from there. But right now, time to go in and hit the gym and, and try to get better. The thing is, I don't think I've really gotten fat in my time of doing things lately. It's just been it's been kind of like up and down, but I've tried to make it a point not to you know eat more than I should be eating because I understand like, okay, well, you know, I'm not really working out as much. So keep those numbers down a little bit and then just kind of, it'll balance out. And that's kind of what it's been for me, but it's about to start getting warmer. It is warmer now. I'm, I'm going to be outside a lot more. So it's time to start dropping down now significantly because I want to like when summer hits, I want to be comfortable, a little more comfortable. So Winter time you get bigger, summertime you drop down. So, let's get it. coming up. I haven't even watched Mandalorian. I may watch it for this next hour. Sure. 
to do. See you guys later. Well, actually, tomorrow's Wednesday, so I'll be here Thursday, so see you guys tomorrow.